Hello everyone, I'm Moon, and welcome back to the forest. Last time on the forest, we went on a trek around the island to kind of explore and see just what else there was around here. We went on a little bit of a trip, we went back to the cockpit, we found another flare gun, though it doesn't seem to have added to it. We got some more uh, goodies, we found some items, we found an old pot ne near a tent, uh, we got ourselves a turtle shell, we went down to the beach, uh, one thing that did happen is we got nicked by a shark. Uh, we didn't quite see it at the time. I looked around, couldn't see what got me, but when went back to the footage, if you saw in the last episode, we saw the dorsal fin of a shark that got me. Also, after that was over, after that session was complete, I kept the camera rolling, I went out, and I basically retraced my steps to go get the stuff again. Uh, nothing of note happened, didn't even encounter any cannibals on the way. I did, in fact, get something new, though, something I didn't encounter the last time. If I had gone up the beach just a little bit, I would have found, well, there was a grave. Just a stone pile, about the shape of a human body, with some sticks marking as a cross shape. And you find something, and it gets added to your book. Uh, let's see, you go down here to notes, and you find a photograph that says June of 82. And it was kind of near where the yacht is. But that's that's all we've got. Now we've, uh... So we're back. In our little base. And looks like I'm hungry. Now there's a few things I can do with the new items I've got. So let's, uh... Let's just get, get ourselves started. There's a few things I kind of have in mind I want to do. I'm kind of getting some ideas for a very special episode, but we'll wait until then. So let's, uh, let's get myself something to eat. Yum, 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 yum. I'm going to hold on to the turtle shell just for now. Oh, let's see. Can I go? Give myself a little bit to drink. All right. Yummy, yum, yum, yum. All right, we got plenty of sticks. There is, let's see, something that's gonna help me out. Got a few extra logs. Let's just go ahead and work on the staircase because I was thinking this is a good place to kind of hide out. If the, uh, well, we've seen a hint of the big guy that kind of roams around. He's out there somewhere. He hasn't been back around. Let's plant some new seeds. He hasn't been back around for a while, but uh, we know he's out there, and he can break down walls, and we need to be wary of this. So, I don't think he can break into the hull of a plane. Are you still not doing the bunny bump? This is getting concerning, you two. So I don't think he can get into the plane, so it's a good place to set ourselves up in case the big invasion happens. Let's see. There's something I can use. A log holder. A log sled. This is actually something I should have made quite some time ago, but with the forest constantly regenerating, this thing hasn't been, well, quite as necessary because trees are always nearby. And probably in the next couple episodes, the forest is going to regenerate again, maybe, unless they fix that update. Because for quite a time, that wasn't actually happening. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I hear him. Hi. Bye. You dead? You're dead. Well, welcome to the party. I'm just gonna put you right there. Are you the only one? Do you have a friend? No friend, huh? Alright, let's see. What What is my body parts fresh? Oh, there is... Let's go a bit dark, shall we? Let's... Another one? Yep. You can put the body parts... Who triggered that? Oh, I didn't even see you. Hi. Welcome to the party. Uh, let's see, they usually 
I think they don't... Well, I was wondering if maybe you drop stuff. You seem to drop stuff. Oh, well. It's a bit dark, but you can... <laughs> put up their body parts. You can actually eat a cannibal. Now, let's see. You can fully eat one of these guys. You can put them on a fire. It's basically like drinking the bad water. But, um... It will get your hunger in a pinch. Which, considering my bunnies aren't doing the bunny bop... I'm gonna have to resort to other food sources in an emergency. So we'll just chop these guys up. Oh. I carry another head? Come on. I got your arm off. Give me your head. Oh, come on. There goes the other arm. I want the head. There we go. Uh, let's see. Got a few skulls. You want to add to our effigy out here? Let's add to our effigy. What do you say? Let's add another stick to the old effigy. We'll add to the, uh... There you go. Show these bastards not to, you know, come around messing with me. It's even a fresh arm, because the food can rot. There you go. What do you think of that? There. Alright. Let's see. Oh yeah, I was working on my special sled. I need a few more sticks. Are there a few more hanging around in my base? Base, base. Space case, base. An arm. Oh yeah, let's... Let's pick up the extra goodies. Why not, right? Keep them in my inventory. Thanks for the head. Give you a heads up. There you go. Could put, actually put the torsos on. Uh, let's not worry about that for now. Let's get ourselves some sticks. Uh, let's see. Oh, yeah. My two fires that I built quite some time ago. Uh, let's see. Any more sticks? Oh, here's some more goodies. Alright, more sticks. Alright, any more goods? I need... How many more sticks? Oh, I've got enough sticks. Make my good old log sled. More aloe? Oh wait, that's my nice. that's my bench right there. Hey, buddy. Could actually have a little bit of real food. Let's get a bit of real food going here, shall we? Kind of save the. Uh, the cannibals for something else. Alright, so we've got ourselves a log sled you can use this thing. It kind of controls a little bit funny. You can see I'm not quite used to using it. Oh, hi guys. You come for a... Go for it. Here, come here. Yeah, that didn't work out so well for you, did it? Oh well. You go add to the pile. There you go. Alright, did you drop any goods? So usually when they die, they'll drop an item or something. But I've noticed if you kill them manually, it's when they when you smack them they drop teeth. You don't seem to drop teeth when you let a trap do the work. Alright, let's get some stuff. Alright, let's work on deforesting this forest. Come here. A little bit goodies. Oh, I'm getting hungry again already. Be careful which way I fell this tree. There we go. Oh, 
Can it break my... Alright, so basically just like the standard log holder. There you go. Wait, there's a village up there? Wait, was that village always up there? Have I been an idiot this whole time? You see that? Up in the distance. There's a village. Did I entirely miss that village? And all this time, there's always been a village up there, and I never noticed it. Uh, let's get plenty of stuff for meds and chicories and... Let's see, any more bunnies? Nope. Alright, well. Sometimes the trap gets triggered. Is that just a big old rock? Alright. So apparently we've been living near some neighbors this whole time. Alright, how many logs did I need? Alright, so as you can see... Is that something? No. Good old log sled. It's good for when you have to go out further. Of course, I didn't need it for this kind of distance, but just to explain how this thing works, it'll become very useful when the forest is very much deforested. Alright. There we go. Our custom stairs finally finished. Well, look, we can get back in here. Still can't carry any more meds. But, hey, look. Got some sodas. Uh, more meds. I don't really need. Okay, I got more sodas. Basically, every time this plane regenerates, I can get in here. But this will be a good place to get in because I don't think the mutants can actually. Ugh, there we go. I don't think they can actually get up in here. I think they. I don't think they can manage stairs very well. So hopefully, let's go. All right. I want to go check out that village. Let's go see what they've got. I didn't realize we had neighbors on both sides of us. This whole time, I thought that was just an empty hill. All right. We'll get going. As you can see, I've been playing a bit on my own, learning how a few items work. I've uh, been playing the forest for just a bit in my spare time. Even on my personal playthrough, I have seen the big mama out roaming about. I've not had yet to worry about them coming after me. Actually, before we get on this, there is something we can make. Let's see. First, let's get our meats up on the uh, cooking rack. Can I not? There we go. Call it the cooking rack. It's the drying rack. So we're mixing, you know, cannibals, meats. But I figure, you know, eating cannibal, you know, it's them or me. Maybe I should eat them first. Oh. Well, there, are they coming down? They're coming down. All right, let's go see. Let's just go see what these guys have to offer, huh? I didn't know we were neighbors up here. I knew about the neighbors out back, but, uh... about the neighbors up here? I didn't know these guys were up here. Should be kind of careful. I'm out in the open. Hey, guys. I didn't know you, uh... had a neighborhood up here. No wonder you guys are so active. Always coming down off the hill. I didn't know you were up here. Feel kind of bad. I brought a cake or something. Here it is. I'm building my property over there. You know, we're neighbors. Always thought the guys out back were just my only neighbors. How's it going, guys? Anybody around? Oh, oh look, you got you got a whole setup up here. Look at this. I'm afraid these go against the homeowners association though. We can't be having that. You know. We gotta have rules up here. Oh look at this. This just this is just tacky, you know. It's like having the flamingo lawn ornaments. It just doesn't seem right. Hey, can I borrow some rope? Do you guys mind? I'm just gonna borrow a bit of your rope if that's okay. 
Oh, look at this. Just tacky. Look at this tackiness. I think I just killed a bird. I did kill a bird. So there's a feather. Give me that feather. Oh. Apparently when feathers hit the ground, they're no longer useful. Alright, well, there doesn't seem to be much I can borrow up here. Wow. Oh, look, an edible mushroom. Hey, guys, you grow mushrooms up here? This is pretty amazing. Hey, can I borrow some of your plants? Look, I feel like we've gotten off on the wrong foot. Alright, we got neighbors up here. Cool. Alright, guys, well. I'm gonna head back down to base. It's no wonder they were so active up on this hill. I always thought, you know, where are they coming from? Turns out that's where. So what about what about our neighbors from behind? Shall we go check out behind? Let's go get a drink. Let's go get myself a drink and then we'll, uh... What do you say? Get a drink and get another quick save? Ooh, what are we growing here? Aloe! I've learned with the gardens, it seems to be what you get is kind of random. You just basically, you have a seed in your inventory. Ooh, I've got a lot of seeds. But basically when you plant them, uh, you can't seem to plant them right away. There seems to be a cooldown period on using your garden, but it's kind of random what you get. Oh, hi. Where did that feather come from? Is there a dead bird? All right, let's let's put our pot to use, shall we? Let's see. There's a lot of different custom building, but a sap collector. There we go. Now, over time, that should start producing sap. How much sap do I have? I don't think I'm in danger of losing sap. Not a lot of leaves. Got some teeth. I've got a tape, but I don't have a cassette player. Well, let's see. We've got... We're getting some stuff. In no danger of running out of leaves. Let's see. Oh, there is something I can make. Do I have... No. I don't have the other items. If I go back down to the beach... I, uh, there's a bomb. I can, I know how to make a bomb. You have to make them out of the, uh, the circuit boards. Uh, but the way to make them is you need a watch, a circuit board, a booze, and coins. Generally coins you can find in a cave. Oh, come on. Come on. I want this. Oh, fuck it. I'll go around. In fact, I'll jump up on us. I'll go up and save real quick, just because we made a little bit of progress on our items. Okay, let's, let's give it a quick save. There we go. All right. We'll go around. We'll get ourselves a drink, and we'll check out our other neighbors. They might have some stuff in their base that I've missed all this time. Which triggered my own trap. There we go. Get something to drink, shall we? Now we've seen Big Mama kind of moving through there. Yep. And actually, I've got a turtle shell. I can uh, make it so I have clean water from now on. I wonder if Big Mama hangs out out here. We've seen the big old spider mutant. We kind of got a glimpse of it. We never got a good glimpse. And I'm kind of fine not having a better glimpse of it. Looks like we got... Hi. Do you see me? Oh, yeah. You see me. I'm going to do it. No mercy. Oh, look. A laptop. Uh oh We've, uh... Hi. Hi. No mercy. Oh. Oh, look, a flare. Come here. 
Whoa, bug. That's a bug. That's a bug. That's a bit of a bug. I've seen it on a couple videos that they launch you straight up into the air. Quit this. I it's a bug that needs to be addressed, but yeah, they can launch you high into the air. You're dead, buddy. There we go. Alright, so we got, let's see, we got some candy bars. It's about to get dark, so I don't want to hang out too much longer. Aha, here's one thing. Special axe. Guys, guys, come on. You're playing? Yep. Oh, come on. There you go. Get your teeth. And you're done. Now let's not hang out too long. I don't want to wear out my welcome too much. I'm starting to get hungry, too. We got a special axe. Let's see. Here it is. The modern axe. Is it better? Uh, let's see. The crafted axe still has... M oh, actually the modern axe has more speed. Uh, but this one has better damage. Of course, this one's been, you know, ramped up on the damage. Let's see. There's a few. It looks. So does. I uh, don't want to be out when it's dark. Let's not dally too long. Is this it? Dynamite. Yes, here we go. Dynamite. That was something else I was looking for. Uh, flare. Let's get back to camp, shall we? It's getting dark. I've kind of upset the neighbors a little bit. Let's, uh, let's not hang out, shall we? May have made the neighbors just a little bit mad, you know. But so far, they're the neighbors I seem to have trouble with. Again, trap is triggered. Well, it's nighttime. Oop. Got a few logs. All right. Let's get ourselves a little bit of a nosh. Oh, I apparently ate the bad one. I apparently ate part of the, uh... Oh, there we go. Two tree sap. So we can now collect sap. Sap is good for repairing items. And of course, as we've seen... Sticking things to our tools. Sap is quite useful. In fact, probably the next episode... We'll see a little bit better applications of the sap. Oh, I can't even sleep yet. I apparently slept late at night, so it's a bit late to be sleeping. Oh well, I guess no harm in that, shall we? Save it up. I think this is a good place to end the episode. Not a lot happened this episode. We went, we saw we have new neighbors. Uh, we finished our staircase so we can kind of hide in our hole. Uh, we did the log sled. We've visited around, we found ourselves a modern axe. Uh, let's see, we got more flares, we got more teeth, we got ten teeth, not bad. Killed a few more of them on our own. Oh yeah, so now we got some dynamite. Four sticks of dynamite, good explosives. Be able to hopefully put them to use. But I say, hopefully we'll, uh... Well, hopefully the neighbors aren't too mad about what happened. You know, the neighbors back there... Seems like the ones up there, they just kind of get caught in my traps, and the ones back there... Oh, can you hear them? I think they're out there. I think the neighbors are angry. But that's all for next time. Hopefully I'll go have a talk with them. Maybe we can iron this all out and maybe find that it was all just a big understanding. Yeah, see, it looks like they're off to a convention anyway. <laughs> So, I hope you're all enjoying the series, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!